Hello everyone, I'm Dr. Sri Banerjee, epidemiologist, biostatistician, faculty member. And in this segment, I'm going to be going over um, uh, over this article uh, in, in honor of Asian American Heritage Month um, in the month of May. Um, so let's go ahead and get started. First of all, um, being an Asian American, there's a lot of um, uh, biases and, and stereotypes that that we face um, I, collectively. Um, while there's um, people from uh, different backgrounds and perspectives in the United States and um, from Asian countries, um, there's collectively still um, some biases. Um, one of them is um, the minorities. The um, it, it's called model minority stereotype, and I'm gonna be talking about this um, in another video, another segment. Um, however, the um, basic premise behind this theory is that um, people that are um, Asian, people that are of Asian descent, and that this actually started um, by classifying uh, Japanese and um, uh, other Asian country um, uh, kids. And so there's this um, stereotype that this is the, the um, Asians are the ideal minority. Um, uh, what this means, um, they're more successful, um, they're, they're, um, they, they actually have um, achieved a lot more than, than other minority groups or um, other groups. And um, that's, that, that, that's really not true. Is it? There's not room for uh, having stereotypes against a whole group of people or a whole race because um, that creates biases um, within the community. So we're not going over um, the, min the um, ideal minorities uh, stereotype in this one. Um, we'll go over, go over some key facts that are uh, pertaining to um, Asian Americans. How many people, how many millions of people will um, 22 million Americans, Asian Americans trace their roots to more than 20 countries in East and South Asian, um, Southeast Asia and the Indian subcontinent. Um, these each have um, rich and unique histories, cultures, languages, and other characteristics. So there's 19 large, uh, the largest 19 Asian origin groups um, account for 97% of the nation's total Asian population. Um, so here's some of the findings um, about these Americans. Um, uh, it's uh, there's updated fact sheets and, and a lot of um, different information that you can kind of click on and um, go into if you're if you want to do more research. Um, this actually shows that um, the Asian population doubled between 2000 to 2019 and is projected to surpass 46 million by 2060. Um, so th th there's quite a number and percentage, and look at um, the drastic increase that took place in the 80s actually um so uh, my parents came in around uh, 1976 so right at the beginning of the boom um and of, of immigration that took place between these years um so the um, u.s asian population is projected to reach as i said 46 million by 2060 um and not not too long ago in 1870 um, only about 660,000 individuals were classified as Asian so the numbers have grown um, by 1960 the first time census respondents could choose their own race 980,000 that's all um, were Asians um, from 2000 to two, 2019 this value actually doubled um, and now is Asians are seven percent of the nation nation's overall population. And that's so. That's some basic facts about um, the Asian American. Um, the con, Asian Americans are considered the single race, um, non-Hispanic segment of the United States um, Asian population. So the single race non-Hispanic segment of the U.S. Asian population makes up a large majority of all Asians in the country. Um, 
and here's the pie chart for this um, there's the Hispanic there's non-Hispanic and then single race um, single race not Hispanic Chinese, Chinese Americans are the largest Asian origin group in the U.S., making up 24% of the Asian population, or 5.4 million people within the United States. So the top the top one is um, uh, so the largest six origins uh, make up 85% of the whole population within the United States. Um, the highest percentage um, is among Asians, is among Chinese. Um, that's at 24%, and then right under that is Indian. Um, and that's 21 percent and, and that would be my um, uh, consider my heritage um, and then Filipino is 19 um, percent um, and um, then Vietnamese 10 percent Korean 9 percent and Japanese 7 percent and then all others um, are 15 percent um, so there's um, as you can see there is um, many flavors of um, Asian um, that comprise this group Um, nearly half of U.S. Asians live in the West, with nearly a third in California alone. Um, aside from Hawaii, where U.S. Asians accounted for 57% of the population in 2019, Asians made up the largest share of the overall population in California. Um, and um, well, then next is Washington, next is New Jersey, and next is Nevada. So people from Asia made up about 14% um, of the 10.5 million unauthorized immigrants in the U.S. in 2017. And um, the 15 countries, top 15 countries um, with unauthorized immigrants from India is the highest um, at 525,000. Next is China, 375,000. Um, Philippines, 160,000. Korea, 150,000. And then U.S.-born Asians are much younger than the rest of the um, Asian American population. So this sums up um, some of the key uh, components and uh, percentages that are um, important to know. Um, there's um, a lot of indicators, um, poverty rate indicators. Um, the mean, mean, median an annual household income in 2019 was 61000 uh, um, now, there is a range um, among Asians. Um, for instance, um, Indians uh, on average make 119,000, um, and then Burmese um, make an average of 44,000. So, by nationality, this looks um, different. And then um, there's a per poverty rate, all Asians 10%. Um, Indians are um, at 6%. Um, so that varies as well. Agents are less likely than Americans um, overall to live in poverty. Um, poverty rates among U.S. born and foreign born Asians were 9 and 11 percent versus the 13 percent in the U.S. And then and more than half of Asians aged 25 and older have a bachelor's degree or more education compared with 33 percent. So in, in different ways, um, uh, Asian Americans um, have, um, have certain things better and then others, um, um, for instance, um, unauthorized um, workers and, and uh, other areas, um, there's not too much different be difference between Asian Americans and other Americans. Um, so let's stop making um, stereotypes and um, start um, creating more open-minded um, understanding of um, all races. I hope this has made some sense. Thank you for listening.